Welcome back, fancy girls. If you're new here, hi, my name is Blanca. And if you're coming back, then welcome back. And if you haven't done so already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell button so you don't miss out when I post a new video. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you girls my coffee bar. And as you girls know, I'm also going to be announcing the giveaway winner at the end. So definitely stay till the end so you can find out if you win. And let's get right to it. All right, girls, here is an overview of my Halloween coffee bar station. And I'm gonna go ahead and go into details about everything on this coffee bar station. The first thing that I'm gonna show you is this wallpaper that I got from Amazon. I am completely in love with it. And up next is this press for coffee sign that I got from one of my friends on the pink community. This is what it looks like. And if you girls can see, it does have a mark on the bottom, but that is because it is real wood. So that's what the back looks like. And then if you girls can notice, it is standing because I have it on a stand, which I got from the Dollar Tree, if you girls are interested in that. And now let's move on to my super cute ghost. He is from Home Goods, and he did used to be orange, but of course I did a DIY on him, and now he is pink. And right behind him, I have my reusable straws. They were also from Home Goods, and they're just cute little ghosts. And of course, they had a pink background, so I needed to have them. And then the other ones just have stars. And then also, I did want to point out that I keep chapsticks inside of this cup because my lips get super dry. Now, moving on to my coffee machine maker or hot chocolate maker because that's what I usually make. Let's point out the crown on it because of course she is the center of my whole coffee station. And now I'm gonna show you girls this super cute ghost mug that I got off Mercari, but he is originally from Target last year. And moving on, I'm gonna show you girls where I keep my hot chocolate cups in this super cute ghost canister that I got from Home Goods, and I did take off the topper off of it because the glass with the bowl did not fit. And also this super cute blue sign that I custom made myself, and I added the cute little bow. And then the little sign here, the countdown for Halloween, there was 32 days left when I recorded this video. And of course I added a cute little bow on the ghost. Let's go ahead and move into the second shelf. I have this gorgeous pink ghost. She is from Home Goods, and of course, I added a cute little bow to her. And then right here, I have this books. The bottom one is Chanel from the Spring and Summer collection, and the second one is from Kate Spade. I did get that one from Home Goods, and then I have my gorgeous pumpkin head with the cute little ghost and i have some candy in there and let's move into my pink mini fridge all i have in there are these two items for my skincare and i do like those to be cold so that's all i have in there moving on to the third shelf i'm gonna start from right to left i have this blue pink pumpkin that i added a black bow to it because it went perfect with the boo since it's in black and also this boo sign is from home goods with the little ghost the boo used to be an orange but of course i painted them pink and last but not least are my marshmallows from amazon and the toppers were actually custom made from a seller on Mercari. She added the little bowls for me and I'm just so in love with them. They're super cute. And here is one last look at my Halloween coffee bar. I am completely in love. 
all right girls that is all for my halloween coffee bar station if you liked it don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and i'm gonna go ahead and announce the winner now and i want to thank everybody that joined as you girls know i try to do this as often as i can so that way i can give back to you for supporting me here on youtube and supporting my business so i'm gonna go ahead and announce the giveaway winner drum roll please all right so the giveaway winner is right here congrats tina i hope you enjoyed this giveaway and i hope you enjoy your bag i know you have always been a super loyal customer to us and i hope that you're enjoying my youtube content as well and if you didn't win don't worry i'm going to be doing another giveaway and i'm planning to do a big one so i'm hopefully going to be partnering up with a few of my youtube friends to do like a bigger giveaway so stay tuned for that and other than that i hope you girls have an amazing day or night whenever you're watching this and i'll talk to y'all later bye Amen.